Tonight, the West Contra Costa County School District held a special meeting to discuss just how to address staff shortages due to rising COVID cases and planned sick outs. Our Corn Forest Taylor Pisaki spoke with teachers at one of the schools in the district who started a petition to district leaders about these very issues. Teachers and parents voicing their frustrations for hours Thursday night during a special meeting held by the West Contra Costa Unified School District to come up with a plan to address high staff shortages due to COVID and planned sick outs. And now you're going to tra transfer teachers, quote unquote, to fill vacancies. Because of that, they don't have enough subs. So my daughter has to go to the cafeteria with a bunch of other classes. And because the cafeteria is so full, she has to sit outside the cafeteria because there's so many classes that aren't covered with subs. At the middle school, similar things. We've had 30 to 40% staff vacancies. Other schools in the district also dealing with similar problems. Stege Elementary School in Richmond, which serves more than 230 students, already had a short staff of about 10 teachers. And in recent days, none of the 10 teachers have showed up at school because they have COVID or they're a part of a planned sick out. Since we're so small, we're very much impacted. When one teacher is out, we are down two teachers already. We're short two teachers. We do not have a fourth grade teacher, and we do not have a one-two teacher, which makes it even more hard. Our principal has had to do duty in the fourth grade class. Teresa Griffin is one of the teachers who signed this petition started at the school demanding KN95 masks for all students and staff and more accessible mandatory testing. Seeking for the district to have a clear plan for staffing shortages and um, the continued surge of the Omicron variant. Sam Clear, who helped organize this effort, says they haven't received a response to their demands yet, and we also haven't received a response from the district. In the meantime, teachers at Steege Elementary say they will not return to the classrooms on Friday. I'm Taylor Bisaki reporting, Cronvore News.